Hi everyone, today I wanted to take you all on a journey through time. A journey to the year 1847. This really is a once in a lifetime opportunity. We're going to get the chance today to compare our lives now to life almost 200 years ago. 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 We sometimes forget to appreciate how lucky we really are to have torches and lamps and, of course, the sun. Hello, sire. I cometh from thine future. 2020. Hey, Darwin, come get a load of this guy. He's from 2020. He speaks like an absolute maniac. Oh, no, I, I, I don't actually speak like that. I was just, just joking. Ah, oh, well, what's it like? The future. Um, well, instead of horses, we have these very fast, very efficient things called cars. Wow, what a substantial advancement in human technology. Yeah, and instead of sending letters, we actually have these very small, very powerful things called phones, and you can talk to anyone, anywhere in the world, instantly. But what about, um, these days, we have these rather loud and obnoxious things called alarms, which we use to wake ourselves up. What kind of incredible invention do you guys have which wakes you up? Hang on, do you mean to tell me that 173 years later, we're using the exact same alarm clocks? No, no, we have something really incredible. It's, um, oh, hang on, I'm, I'm getting a brainwave. A brainwave? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm being called back to 2020. Oh, by the way, humans evolved from apes and natural selection is real. Wow. That was bad guys. If I don't come up with a waker upper this year, I could alter the course of time. You know what? I think I'm gonna have to take one for the team here. Take one for humanity and come up with three new ways to wake yourself up. This one's called the slapper. Instead of your alarm, the idea is you have a remote control car above your head, cardboard attached to the wheel, oh my God. and now when it's time to wake up, oh, holy crap, that is savage, oh my God. If that doesn't make you up, I don't know what will. Holy crap. This one's called the caffeine kick. All you need is a hairdryer. Facing a funnel with a small cup of coffee in between. And now when it's time to wake up. <laughs> Holy crap. I did not expect it to be that intense. Yeah, I probably wouldn't recommend that one. I like to call this one... The Ice Bucket Challenge. You have a balloon filled with cold water attached above your head. Then you have a rotating fan with something pointy attached to it. And now when it's time to wake up... Oh, no, 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 no! Close enough! Oh, crap, my phone's in my pocket, no! So in conclusion... Will I be using an alarm tomorrow? Yes. Yes, I will. <laughs>